one knows where the bombs will fall. International media run. Global climatic changes in the past few years have resulted in many countries to have fallen victim to floods, famines, droughts, and earthquakes. The world has also seen civil unrest and volatility in many countries, due to which normal life of people has been disturbed, resulting in several becoming refugees in neighboring countries or internally displaced in their own countries. Lives of people afflicted by these calamities have been turned upside down. Victims are both mentally and physically traumatized due to the fact that their families, homes and routine life have been shattered. No matter what the kind of the major emergency, be it natural or man-made, Helping Hand, based on our resources and strengths, has always extended full support to those who are in need of emergency assistance with no discrimination whatsoever based on religion, race, creed or color. This positive attitude of Helping Hand towards the victims of emergencies is even more visible as Helping Hand itself came into existence as a result of a major natural calamity. Whatever the emergency situation may be, like for instance the 2005 earthquake of Pakistan or the drought and famine of Horn of Africa 2011-2012 or the volatility in Syria Burma and flooding situation in Bangladesh in 2012, or any region of the world for that matter, Helping Hand ensures provision of basic amenities of life to the afflicted masses. The executive members of Helping Hand themselves have traveled to the affected areas in several projects. Helping Hand not only provides immediate assistance in the key areas of food distribution, water provision, shelter providing, health relief, and in-kind gifts, but also have effective programs in place to facilitate communities to come back on their feet with long-term rehabilitation projects done in an integrated approach in the areas of health facilities, education, shelter, clean drinking water, in-kind gifts, interest-free microloans, capacity building, vocational training institutes, and many more such developmental programs. These crucial life-saving and enhancing activities have been seen in the Haiti earthquake 2010, Egypt, Tunisia, and Libya societal turmoil 2011, Japan tsunami, floods, nuclear threat 2011, the drought and famine in Horn of Africa 2011-2012, the floods in Pakistan of 2010 and 2011, Syria and Burma volatility 2012, Bangladesh floods 2012 and others. Through the generous donations by people like you, Helping Hand tries its level best to take people out of their miseries and to help them in every manner so as to make them self-sufficient. This responsibility that Helping Hand has taken upon his shoulders is on one hand very huge and tedious, while on the other very noble and satisfying. This gracious cause can be enhanced and furthered by your contributions of zakat, sadaqat, and general donation. Ramadan is the month of blessings. It is the month when we fast to get not only the maximum rewards from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, but also to feel what it's like to be in a situation of hunger, thirst, and helplessness. Do remember to visit and encourage others to visit www.hhrd.org and contribute generously towards the various ongoing emergency relief activities in Bangladesh, Burma, Syria, Pakistan, Somalia, Kenya, and Tanzania. Helping Hand wants you to have inner peace by making that feeling pragmatic enough by contributing and being a part of the program. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala shower His blessings on the whole of mankind. For more information on Emergency Response Program, please visit our website www.hhrd.org or call us at 1-888-808-4357.